Yeah, thank you, Anna. V602. Now to this uh, update on the breaking news we've been tracking since our 430 newscast. A wild police chase that took over the Houston freeways this morning. We're hearing now there's a standoff in the Schulenburg area. Now these are some of the images of that chase courtesy of Houston Transstar. KPRC 2's Brittany Jeffers is following the story. And Brittany, uh, where are, where's the chase now? Where are you? Well, I'm on the west side of Sealy, but just to update everyone within the last hour, I did speak with representatives at the Fayette County Sheriff's Office, and they tell me that right now that suspect is stopped, as you mentioned, at a standoff in the Schulenburg area. Now, this chase has lasted close to two hours at this point. Now, we do have a look at some of the pursuit that we captured courtesy of our Houston Transtar cameras. According to the Harris County Precinct 5, the suspect was asleep at the wheel, and when deputies tried to pull him over around 3 o'clock this morning, he took off. Now, that suspect, they say, got on the Katy Freeway. He's been headed westbound ever since, going through the Memorial area, Katy, Brookshire, now in Schulenburg. And after a two-hour chase, uh, Precinct County 5 deputies say they were able to spike the suspect tires outside of Schulenburg. Deputies say he went about five miles on three rims and then started firing gunshots outside of his window. Now, at this point, we do not know if that suspect is in custody, but we have uh, we did hear that the suspect is in a standoff with dep deputies refusing to get out of his vehicle. They do say that he has a gun. Of course, we will keep you updated as we learn more. Reporting live in Sealy this morning, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News. Brittany, thank you.